Welcome everyone to the Dice Tower Unboxing. I'm Joey Evans, and now we are taking a look at a couple games here. First off, Phil Walker Harding Spellbook, and then we're going to look at Lawyer Up Season 2. I have not played this. I know Tom has. So let's tell you what, let's go ahead and open this up. Again, this is just an unboxing. I'm not going to go into how the game works or many details at all. Just want to show you guys what is inside the box. Before we get to that, this is by Rock Banner Games, 14 plus and looks like one to two players and about 60 minutes. All right, here we go. Now this box, from what I hear, you could actually put season one in there as well because you that do know Lawyer Up, the first one, you'll notice that this box is a lot larger. Okay, so three replayable cases and robust solo mode included. Private Eye, Casino Heist, and Divorce. Huh. Kind of took a turn, didn't it? That's kind of, kind of sad. All right, so we'll take this away. There we go. All right. Oh, yeah, lots of space for probably the Season 1 expansion, maybe future ones. All right, take a look at the rulebook. Here's the rulebook on this. Goes into each one. Text into the case. Lots of examples. Like the solo game, glossary. You got quick reverence on the back. I do like how they do that. Oh, now we got some tokens. All right. And these do pop out fairly easily. All right. You've got some dials here. There we go. No reason to open these up and show them to you. But I can just in case. Here we go. All right. So these are the different dials. Two, one per player right there. Got some dice, and you got some small tokens on here, see if we can focus on that. Got some like, thumbs up, skulls, hearts, magnifying glass. All right, All right. so those are these. Got one more die, different sides on it. And then here we go, more tokens. All right. Then also, you're going to have some different cards in here, smaller cards. Let's go and look through this. Prosecution, defense. I'm going to, not going to go through all these cards, really what they do at all, just to show you the artwork and look at the quality of the cards and how many cards you do have with this. Okay. Sentimental. For each heart asset you've won or share, gain two victory points. Okay. All right, so... Those are these. Some other cards here. Let's open these, and then we're going to open one of these larger ones here just to show you again the artwork on those. All right. These look like different people. Defendants, or oh, the muscle, the gambler. All right. Bias objections, solo content, and the different cases on this. All right, show the back of these. Okay, so that's some artwork on those. And let's go ahead and open this up. Again, not going to open all these. It does come with lots of different cards. I'm not really sure there are going to be spoilers in this or not, so I'm going to go through them fairly quickly um, just so you can see the artwork and the style. Okay, qu card quality on these is fine. It's good. All right, lots of cards here. Okay, here we go. Silver Onyx, Stiletto, Lips Period Napkin, Tire Tracks, Stolen Stocks, Planted. Okay, Strangle Marks, Murder Weapon, Planted. Okay, all right, so go through these. Consistent artwork through it. Looks good. It actually makes me more interested in playing the game. That's very interesting. All right. We'll place these here, and again, lots of space for future game, for the future expansions, it looks like, as well as Season 1. Okay, so now let's push this aside here, and let us take a look at Spellbook by Phil Walker Harding. Let's see if we've got a player count somewhere. Space Cowboys, I do see that on the side. All right, so... 45 minutes, 12 plus, and one to four players. So apparently there is a solo mode with this. 
All right, open this up. And both of these will be, of course, reviewed on the channel, probably. We don't promise anything, but I know people that are excited about both of these. All right, so, spell book. All right, the rule book. Been through, go the game, game turn, spells. All right, the appendix. Goes more detail into it. And the dot designers here. And it goes into solo mode on the back. And this is how to assemble. Looks like it's going to be something in here that does assemble. You do assemble. All right. These right here. Oh, this is nice. Look at this artwork here. Really good. Ooh. Nice. These do pop out really easily. I'm going to show you some of the artwork on this. Here we go, our work on this guy too. Okay. All right, and this right here is gonna be what you do, kind of pop out and assemble through those instructions. All right, ooh, let's open these up here. Oh, these are nice, these feel nice. It's kind of like acrylic, I'm not sure what they are, but they feel really, really good you see that on there do you see how they shine okay very nice okay put those in here and then you've got some bags here as well or maybe one bag i believe one large bag okay i think it's to put the tokens in this underneath this might have actually come out of one of these here all right, and now let's take a look at some of these cards. You've got two of these. I'm not going to open both, but we will go ahead and look at these just so you can kind of get an idea of how the artwork does look on this game as well. All right, these are a little bigger than tarot size cards. There we go. All right. Okay. don't have rounded edges. Which I always find it odd that they don't have rounded edges. Those get bent very easily, but there might be a reason. All right, take a look at the artwork on this. Look at the back first. Different colors here on the back. And now let's take a look at this artwork here. Here we go. Let's read. Just pick one of these. Ah, he looks like a good one. Here we go. Offering. Store four of the same color. Store three of the same color. Store two of the same color. So I can get that glare to go away so you can see some of these. That's bright. Artwork is very pretty on these. These do look really, really good. Wow. Yeah, look at that. Oh, I like that, I like that look too. That's really nice. All right, a little game turn. This does go through a little bit of player aid. Good. There might actually be, yep, another one right here. Good. There's probably some more on the other side. All right, so there we go. Um, that is Spellbook by Phil Walker Harding. All right. Thanks, guys. Bye.